Wow, you guys want to move forward and create. You are ready. This is what you want. This is what you're uh, working towards. And no wonder you're exhausted. Maybe you've done everything you can. You're trying to force it. Don't force it. Um, keep, just remember, you know, I know you want to manifest this. I know you have everything that you need within yourself to do this, okay? But maybe it's not the right timing at this very second. Uh, or, you know, you're just waiting for something. Something might be holding it up. However, um, don't let that deter you at all. You will succeed. You are already succeeding. And um, you're moving forward in something really amazing. You're going to be manifesting something very important to yourself. And it's going to be very important to others. Um, so this is what you're wanting. You've worked towards it. You are going to manifest this. But right now, um, it looks like there's a little bit of a postponement, okay? Um Maybe there is a postponement because you're waiting on there. You don't have the finances available to you, to you yet. This is the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. This is the Knight of Pentacles. It is in reverse. So I think it's just timing right now. You're just waiting for the right time um, for this project to take effect for you to move forward. Um, there's just a tad bit of a delay. That's all. No big deal. Um, you know, this could be finances. This could be an offer that uh, you're unable to bring in right now. Um, job, relationship. I'm not sure what this is. You're trying to, uh, we'll get some more details. Okay. Uh, in the past, you were overwhelmed. There was a, maybe some too much. You were too busy. Maybe you had too many decisions to make or a decision to make. Um, maybe it got to you. You were overwhelmed, but you're no longer overwhelmed. You put this in the past. You were really busy or you were just way overwhelmed with whatever this is. Um, you've made peace with that. That's in your past. And now you are, this is either you, Libra, you are coming forward and you're ready to offer a relationship. You're ready to offer compassion, love. You're able to offer the dedication um, and the time to, to manifesting whatever this is you want. Okay. Or if this is not you, Libra, this is a water sign. This is a... Cancer, Pisces, or, um, I'm sorry, I'm blanking out, blanking out. <laughs> it's a water sign. Um, and you know, this person has a lot to offer. They have love to offer. They have compassion. They're a very stable person. They're very loving and they have a lot to, to a lot of wisdom and, and, um, generosity. So this person is coming in, to, this energy is coming in for you. Um, it might help you manifest this. Um, what you're wanting to manifest. It could be um, helping you with this. Uh, maybe there was a reason why, you know, you can't move forward at this very moment in which you want to. Okay. Um, but here you are. This is the, the chariot. This is, uh, and actually this is like kind of a Libra card. Um, this is a very balanced person. They're balanced in their plans and in their relationship and in their mind. They are confident because they're they are in, they're successful. They've achieved uh, the wisdom, the information, the knowledge, and they are so confident and they're so ready to move forward. And you guys are going to be move, moving forward, and you're hoping to move forward with this brand new uh, manifestation. You've done all the work, and you are definitely, 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 definitely moving forward. You have this wonderful person coming into your life. This person's going to either help you or just be a part of what's going on. Um, or this is your energy coming in this month. You're ready to go. You're ready to offer love or, you know, I don't know what you're offering here, what you're manifesting, but we will maybe go a little deeper here into the reading. Um, but you're ready and it's exciting because, you know, this is a great positive forward movement energy. Okay. Um, the energy here in the middle, the main man energy is this, the sun in reverse. The sun usually is, you know, somebody who is, uh, it could mean many things. Okay. But, um, this is a very free, independent, free, uh, free flowing, positive, um, bringing attention and, uh, focus and for, and, and kind of just letting go, just kind of being happy and free. Okay. But it is in reverse. So there might be, um, some arrogancy. Okay. Watch out for that. Don't be too arrogant. Don't be too confident guys. If this is you Libra and you're overly confident, um, scale it down, scale it down just a tad. 
uh, be happy, be, be positive deep for hundred percent, be, be, um, be, um, secure and, uh, you know, confident in who you are. That's, that's a given. You got to do that, but just don't overdo it is what I'm saying. You don't want to over, over indulge or over, uh, overthink something or over push too hard because, you know, it could create, uh, you know, this arrogancy or, you know, uh, forcing of something. But if it's not that, if it's not arrogancy, you know, if it's not you, um, it's just an energy in which it's still a very positive energy. It's just that it hasn't manifested to its full level yet. It's still a very beautiful, independent, happy movement type of a card. So it's just, you're going to be moving, you are going to be moving forward. Okay. Uh, I think it might have to do with timing. Okay. Cause I, I, I see here that, that you don't have right now at this very second, what it is a hundred percent that you need in order to move forward. So even though you want to, you're ready, you, you, you want to, and you actually are ready mentally. Um, there may be finances that you still need, uh, in order to move forward, um, or something you need to think about a little bit more. Okay. So you're looking at the situation in a way where, um, this is you Libra. This is you. Um, this is a male or a female because this is a general reading and you're a little bit, um, Un insecure, uh, unstable financially or emotionally. So we left off basically saying the queen of pentacles was here for you. This is how you're looking at the situation. Um, you're kind of looking at it like, um, maybe you're tired and you don't have the, um, energy right now. Um, even though you do want to move forward and you are seeing things right now in a really positive way, you might actually just need to take some time out and take a break. So you're kind of looking at this like right now you don't have the energy uh, to put forward on this movement. Um, and, you know, you also have this Knight of Pentacles here, which, you know, indicates same thing, kind of the same thing. You just kind of need to take a break. Um, you might be tired right now because you know you did put already a ton of work in whatever this is that you want to move forward in that you've been waiting for moving to, to move forward in um uh, maybe this person's coming into your life now and you know you're ready to manifest and, and start something new here that's really going to bring you a lot of happiness and joy but right now i think you're just exhausted so you guys do 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 take this time to take a break um you really do. You need to take some time to relax. Absolutely. Don't rush. You know, this stuff is still going to be here for you. This amazing, beautiful energy, um, this, this, this freedom, this joy is still coming. It's going to happen. Just, um, be patient, um, and move forward, but don't uh, move too fast. Okay. You guys, uh, because you do need to take some time out for yourself and relax. Um, and I know you're just probably so excited to move. You haven't probably felt this way in a really long time. So you might, you might wanting to just hurry up and move forward. Uh, but be, be mindful of your energy level. And, um, you know, there is going to be some possible work that you need to put in this project or in this forward movement. So, um, you know, there's a balance between excitement and energy levels and also, um, work that you've already put forward, you may need to take break is all. Okay. And it looks like you're coming out of a time where you were feeling un like emotionally drained or emotionally, um, unable to know which direction to go in confusion, um, mental exhaustion, uh, lack of clarity, um, but it, it, you're coming out of that now, you know, and that's why the sun cards here, you're, you have all of a sudden some clarity, some freedom that you haven't had in a really long time. So this might've been something that, uh, you were trapped in for a while. Um, and you know, this is what you're, you're also afraid that, um, you know, there's a part of you that might be afraid that this is too good to be true, or that it might be, uh, something that you might you know, might get addicted to it because it's so nice. And so, uh, such a great energy and moving forward in such a positive direction. Um, but don't be concerned, you guys, if, you know, obviously you're going to know if it's something that, you know, is negative towards you or not, but, um, of course, if it's negative, don't go towards it. But, uh, I, th I just think that's more of a fear that you're having. Um, you're just worried maybe that you're going to get like it too much. Um, cause I, I think that this is, um, 
something that you've wanted for a really long time and it is coming forward now you are going to have some clarity you are going to have the uh the desire to do something beautiful this person's coming into your life they're very wonderful and uh generous and loving um you might be you know this could be a, a romantic relationship we're talking about um if it's not it could be a work situation just be in mind that you guys do and may need to put some effort and energy into this a little bit so make sure you get the rest is all it's saying. Okay. Um, this is a great reading, a great energy for you. I'm going to pull, uh, one more card here for mid month reading for Libra. Let's go ahead and get, um, some clarity for the King of Cups. Please clarify for our Libra, this, um, uh, King of Cups energy. So, okay. So the King of Cups is coming in. Maybe uh, he hasn't been acknowledged in the past. Uh, maybe you're not really paying attention. Paid attention. Maybe he, you didn't pay attention to this person in the in the past. Okay, um, it could have been somebody that wasn't. Um, Maybe you didn't notice them. Um, maybe you didn't notice this, notice how generous this person was. Maybe you weren't focusing that much on this person, but now this person is coming forth and there is going to be focus with on this person. Okay. This, uh, it, it looks very satisfying. This person is emotionally fulfilled and they are happy. This is a very, very, very happy person. Um, this is a very, this is a person that wants to communicate. They want to communicate with you. They want to, um, let you know how they feel and, or bring you some information, um, in regards to something that you need, but this is a fantastic person coming forth. Okay. You guys have a great month. I'm going to pull, um, rest of the month. I mean, you guys are moving towards something beautiful. Please get rest. Don't, and take the time, you guys, don't be, um, it's basically was saying, don't be, uh, don't be lazy. If you're feeling, you know, lack of energy, try to move forward, but also get rest at the same time. Cause you guys do need that. I'm going to go ahead and pull, um, one of these wonderful cards we have for the, um, our goddess tarot, uh, goddess Oracle cards for Libra mid month for Libra. What is the message for Libra? Wow, we got a message right away. Quiet time. So you are being guided to take some quiet time. Take some quiet time alone to rest, meditate, and contemplate. Beautiful. Do that, you guys. You really worked hard. Too hard. So take some time and go within. Okay, I'm going to pull another one for you. What's another message for Libra? What is another message for Libra? Really? Okay. This one popped out. Compassion. Release judgments about yourself and others and focus on the love and the light that is within everyone. Here we go. So have some compassion. 